Hey, hi, Angel here. Hi, I'm uh, driving up to Colorado, actually, from Albuquerque, and um, passing through La Bajada Hill, and I thought I would show you this kind of cool terrain in case you're, if you haven't been here before, this is a lava flow, like, oh, like ledge of lava flow. I don't actually know all the geography of it. I should re-familiarize myself with it. I've read the little, the little sign and a couple little blurbs, but uh, it's been a while since I read any, and I don't exactly remember, but I do know that up here you're gonna see in a minute there's a shift from this red clay earth to this black lava rock and uh, black basalt from old volcanic activity here in New Mexico. And as you can hear from my car, it's a pretty hefty climb and elevation. And there used to be a, like there still are remnants of a switchback trail along that ridge that a uh, old wagon, wagon trails before we blasted highways through it. Anyway, it was a formidable, you know, thing to get down, I guess, back in the wagon trail days. And you can see that black, now I don't know if you can make it out on this camera or not, but that's black basalt rock all blown up around the state. And a lot of the state, I don't know, I'm going to try to show you over here, but I can't really look where you're looking. But back there, that's Cochiti Lake tucked in those mountains. And then the Jemez Mountains, tent rocks up there. Some really neat ge geological, geographical features in this area where the terrain switches kind of abruptly from mountain terrain to high mountain step, I guess I think it would be called, and maybe uh, some plains, high plains. So anyway, now we're climbed up. I think you might be able to see the the snowy caps of Santa Fe off there to, uh, I think it's, it's my left. I'm not sure if this camera might be flipping us around. Anyway, snowy caps over there off to the far side of the road and uh, out on this side, just kind of plains, go out to southern New Mexico, it gets even more plainsy. We're, as you can see from the sign coming up, just about to drop into what I guess I would call the Santa Fe Valley. It's, I don't know if it's quite formally a valley, but it kind of is. It's surrounded by, mostly by mountains, if you count what we're about to drop down as a mountain, which it really isn't. It's just really a rise, but uh, so we rose up on that other side of La Bajada Hill. I'm gonna keep you with me here, show you around a little more terrain. It's a beautiful day out there, isn't it? We got some, we got some just terrific blue sky. It's a, what they call a bluebird day. If I, uh, if I wasn't on my way to work in Colorado, I just pissed that person off. Whoopsie! I would be on my way to snowboard, perhaps, because it's a beautiful Sunday and I have a pass to Santa Fe over here. And even though there's not a lot of snow. As you can see from these caps that you're about to see again, there is a little snow. Watch, here it comes. Here it comes. Ready, ready, ready. Dropping into the Santa Fe Valley here. You can see Santa Fe spread out down there. And the snowy caps up above. That's a pretty view, isn't it? Coming down off of La Bajada Hill. I'm going to go ahead and sign out and wish you a merry day on your merry way. Until next time, peace, prosperity, and possibilities oh yeah and positivity and potential that's right until next time ciao